Hi everyone, Simulet here and today we're gonna be doing um, a back to school haul for my sophomore year that is 2017 to the same thing. So this year I'm a sophomore, yay! So sorry for the break, for the wait, I was taking some time from YouTube and today we are back on. So I start um, school on August 8th and let's go. I'm not gonna send the name, uh, but yeah, I started on August 8th and it was so early because of the strike we had and everything in the university and everything. But they want to set for fast a win um, on December 14th with finals and everything, so yay! Okay, so in here I'm gonna show you what do I really use, what I need for my school. So I have my book like in here. It's full already of everything I need. So let's start. First off, this is my book. Do you love it? I love it. It's from Costco. It was I think twenty dollars. So it's high Sierra. And down below in the description, I'm gonna put everything I have. So first off, I'm gonna put it and I have all the paper because I was doing um putting through so it doesn't damage. For us, we have a Spanish novel called La Charga. Then we have English, French plus to kill a monkey bird. Um, animal Farm. Uh, what else? Oh, we have Espanol, para Espanol. Spanish class, we have Postumo el Transmigrado. I don't know. Some novels. We have Mouse 2. I haven't read one or anything, but um, we also have collections grade 10 so cute we also have uh, Puerto Rico for um, history class I, I my math book is gonna be an ebook and my chemistry book is also gonna be an ebook I'm gonna have it on my phone, on my computer, on my tablet. I really don't know. But yeah, um, I still don't have two English novels for English class. Duh. But yeah, in here I also have my school year planner. You guys really need a planner. This is from Blue Sky. I love it. You see in here. Then it's your information, and then well, you have the months, and then and then the weeks. So yeah, it's so for you to get organized. And yeah, that's it for books. Oh, I also have before we get a clipboard. I don't know if you guys saw this. Through my labels, this is a clipboard, super cute. Uh, my mom bought it from I think it was always at nine. Um, it was like two dollars, I think. It's from Basic. Here you go. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna make. And this again, it was ten dollars. I know it's pricey, but it's big, and I write big, so this is good for me. But if you want a smaller agenda, planner, student planner, you also can buy this. I think hope to put five dollars or something like that. I also have, I can put on my makeup, but these two pocket portfolios or I don't know, put on the um, bases in here. So it's two pockets, you can put your papers in here. I have two because I have one classes on Monday and one day I don't know, classes Thursdays and Tuesdays and Thursdays. And I also have all cards classes um friday so i need to have one for this day and one for the other days i also have um filler paper um it's called here papel de or whatever you call it uh it's super good 
is um, it has mineral lines and I can rise up and if they ask me for something I really use it uh, also if you guys want to you know protect your box with clear things so it doesn't damage I recommend you to use um, cut paper or magic cover paper it's just make cover it was one dollar on Walmart and those stores here in Puerto Rico so it's super cheap and really recommend it so your books doesn't damage like please I don't want you to break your books also if you throw it or it falls it doesn't damage and it keeps the book in good condition and I sell my books for the next that is going to the next year going to be for my I'm gonna be union so when I sell the books so they they do need it the same book so I sell them and when it's like this in clear printed paper it's in good condition so I can sell a good price not a cheap price because the books are costly like this book is only eighty dollars I think I bought it for fifty dollars and it was in good conditions but new it cost like eighty dollars so or so so super sh super pricey and I bought a cheap price and it's used so it's in good condition okay so then I have my notebooks I don't know how notebooks I'm gonna use but um, all the notebooks I had I put them in a call I didn't like plus I have all these books so they can last me till next semester I did even collage this one, two, three, four, five. You see, it has my name, so I don't have to make it. This one, I lost count. Oh, uh, this one because of location, so this one's cute. And this is are from magazines and everything. It's not pictures of mine. So yeah, those are my notes. And Sorry, I also have this notebook. Oh, I think it's for chemistry class. So I did it like this, super cute. Using, I also put um contact paper. So it and it has my logo here with my name, my student number, and school. And just in case I lose it, I think I will. But if I do, for some convenience. Okay. Okay. I know this is my. But I also have my YouTube class, and but this I mean, well, before we get into that, this book is um Spiral Notebook, and it's five divisions, and it was like three dollars, um Walgreens. So yeah, is the really prices mark? I don't think it's five star or something. Yeah, it's, in Walgreens it cuts super cheap. I recommend you if you're gonna use Spiral Notebook. It was one division, three divisions, five divisions, but super cheap in Walgreens. Then I have my notebooks. These are from Office Max, Office Debug, whatever. It was like uh, 50 cents, something, and yeah, it's just college rule. I really like this because it's, I can write more in a page. It's eight pages. But I have these ones that are from Walmart for the same price college rule and it has I think it's 100 pages or something like that but they don't have these ones left so I bought this but I don't care I use this semester I use new notebooks each semester so yeah that's good for me uh super cheap notebooks really um uh, 50 cents is super cheap um for Rico then I have my user size and by this time you can see scissors, pens, uh, pencils. So I have two boxes from stuff. I don't know how you call it. We have here called cappuccino, but it's personal bags or search bag or pencils cases. I don't know how you call it. But this one's two sides. Um, in one side that is here, I have pen, uh, pencils. I have um. These are mechanical pens. I like only use mechanical pens, so I have, um, I think the rifle. I don't know how uh, here is called puntas, <laughs> puntas like um new shock or something. I have erasers here, erasers in here. On the other side, I have um, rules. I have one more eraser that I really like. These erasers, a scissor, and a bookmark, and more whatever is stuff 
good it goes in the bottom. It kind of cool. Then I have all the pencil pens in here. I have all my pens, highlighters. I have also have liquid paper to raise stuff because some clothes like you need to use pens. Oh my god, you need pencils so so. Uh, I have a stapler, mini stapler. Uh, I have this. Uh, it used to be mints. No, it's not mints. I have paper clips and that's uh, the holster papers for if I need to have something, turn something in. I have glue. I have this glue that's from Walmart's 60 cents, I think, and this Walmart's um, stick glue. That one was um, two for two for one. So super shit. Uh, this table I have been with this for years. So I really know the price, but I think it was from Office Max. Um, two dollar, I think. My mom really buys um specials, and I really recommend. Oh, uh, let me put this in here. Uh, liquid paper. I was, I think it was fifty cents. Yeah, I'm picking, um, two for one dollar or something. Then Walmart, I bought it. And this, I really recommend this app. Uh, you have no mens or or picture for this. You can put stuff in, and it's super easy to put your paper clips, paper holders, whatever you call them. And it's a good way to start fix or even girls that use tampons or pads. That is the idea. And talking about your stuff. Here I have some less for something. It's a pencil tape thing, and it has all my emergency kits, uh, kits and everything that I need. And I guess I get to group school and something. This will go in my locker. I think this will go in my locker because it's practical. I also have these thingies that is emergency stuff that my sister got me. Here I have my beauty case. Um, uh, that is a uh, chef six uh, mascara. In case I want to look fabulous, um, else and in here exactly I have cream, deodorant, lip gloss, shaptix, Vaseline, all the stuff. Um, I also have baby lips. It's in here. I need. I those don't go in the case because the case I think it will go in my locker. This will go in my bag in case I just need it. I have the mirror. Hey guys, you see me up? Okay, and I also have what is it? I lost it. Uh, I, I have here um, a mini brush for school. I guess I want to brush my hair. Oh, my hair looks horrible. I didn't get time to do it at home. This I have it with me on my backpack. So, yeah, I also have a mirror. And on the back, here we have a mini things like this in case your clothes rip up or um, if you're in private school I think those use uniforms my school doesn't use uniform well it is from seven to nine but now in, in ten to twelve we don't use uniform so in case I rip my shirt up and I need to do a little stitches this is practical okay so moving on I also have I also have this one this goes on my locker in case I forgot my pencil cases at home this is in my locker. It has razors, pencils, and pens. It's practical to have one in your locker if you have a locker because it's super easy. If you, oh my god, I forgot my pencil case at home when I was doing homework. This will help. You can also add scissors, uh, glue, everything you like to add. Over here, I have my pencils, color pencils in case I um, need to color something. I don't know if I'm gonna be in art class or things, but it's at 12. I'm crazy like it was only one dollar or something. So super cheap. Oh this I did with my brother it's a pencil case and in storage uh the pencil was one dollar dollar tree my art brand from US so super practical to have on this while well, here was some things that I bought from hard candy and I used to search trash, star stuff. This was from a gift from an insurance company. Okay. Um, in here I have in scarves. A lot of teachers ask for in scarf for when you're um I don't know studying for tests and you need to dress up or turn stuff in. This is good, practical. 
this is a case and in here I have 100 in this cards ruled in this cards that I bought from Home Depot I think it was from Dollar or something my mom bought it because my mom likes when they're special the store so she can buy but our back to school stuff so yeah super practical yeah okay so then I have my pen drive I have usually have two pen drive one for my locker one for my backpack if I forgot the one in my backpack so I was doing homework I have the other one in my locker and I, I would almost save save stuff Oh, and in here, this was a Crayola box, crayons box or anything. But now I use it to search my post-its. Uh, you see, those post-its have to mark stuff on my notebooks, my books, um, my planner, everything. Okay. I also have my glasses cases in case I'm playing and I want to use my glasses. And I also have this to play in my glasses in class before I see them somewhere. Oh. My glasses are dirty, so this is practical if you use glasses, even if it's all the time, have this in your backpack or in your locker. Um, let me see. Oh, I also have this mint. If you ate lunch and didn't have them, this will help you so you don't have bad breath. And last but not least, we have pills. I uh, had a pills. Uh, if you have. Um, prescription drugs use them this is good this is a package from 40 tablets of uh, faint pain relief ibuprofen so these are good on the go and this is um it's a strange headache relief because i have sometimes have some bad headache these are good this is 100 this was like two dollars this was one dollar walmart walmart also this is a um, cheap one but this helps so much and I also have here you know, I have one pen um this was one dollar of the max paper made I also use fake um this also more pencils up to fifty cents um I have the uh no this one not okay so here you need to identify yourself. This is an optical uh, address. Uh, these are normal folders. No, I use them in a very app. I use this. Turn, turn the labels, and those are good to identify. You can put on a picture like me, and then write your name, student number, school, what major in, whatever stuff you like. But it's good to identify stuff. All my books have it. I'm on novels have it because I've left something. I haven't done on my pencil case, but I really did it in this pencil case I have. It really, it has my name, the number, and student numbers like what grade you are in. So we will see the first four letters of the student number. Okay, she's a sophomore. No, she's a junior. No, she's a senior. No, she's a freshman. Like that, you see what grade you are. So people go to classrooms with those teachers from those grades. So this is easy if you start, or when you go to the office, say, oh, my student number is 12, uh, etc. This is my name, and I lost this. Okay, it's in the office. They have it because it has your name and student number. That's a good idea. So, yeah, I think this is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my back to school haul. Love you guys, and get ready give it a like I'll get ready for new things coming here um I will soon do a back to school clothes haul more hauls I think you want to do uh reviews from books etc etc tell me what you want me to do for you so comment down below in the description I have everything about it and the price in store uh for bread and but that I mean no books uh pencils, pencil case, and everything. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Smash the thumbs up, subscribe, and click on the bell so you get a notification every time I post a video every Friday. Now it's Friday, not Tuesdays. Friday. So, hope to see you guys soon, and bye.